What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. If you guys are new here, I'm Carter Share, and today we have a very interesting video. That is because we are going to be doing a Lamborghini gold digger prank on my new girlfriend. Well, I guess it's actually more of a gold digger test to see if she is a gold digger and if she's just dating me for the money and fame or if she's dating me for me. That's what we're gonna find out today. And uh, we got this old Lamborghini Countach out of storage today and it's been sitting for a while and it was uh, not the easiest thing to get started. Check this out. Oh, it's been a minute since I've seen this video. Oh no. Wow. The fire's a little low. Oh no. Oh, we didn't bring a pump. Oh no. <laughs> oh shit. It's pretty low stuff. Ooh, I think it's, you know, the pressure, air pressure on it. Got to it. The winter's out here are brutal in LA, guys. <laughs> and this is an old Lamborghini, guys, so. Starting it after it's been sitting for a while is always a tough thing. So this is gonna be an old start, cold start. It hasn't been started for a couple months. Let's see if this thing is gonna start. Guys, give it a big thumbs up. Comment down below if it's gonna start on the first go. I think it is. I should have kept it alive, but I thought we had it. Sometimes when this thing sits, it is hard to get it started, but I really want to use it for the video today, so let's, let's work on it. I think with you know, a little bit of a, a little rub right here. It's a whole This is it. This is the one. Come on. It took, uh, it took uh, probably like a couple tries, but we got it going. Only thing is, we gotta get out of the garage now. I can't believe we got it. I can't believe we got it started. Carter is in his Lambo, as you guys can tell. I'm in my car. I'm going to be following right behind him just in case anything does happen, like if it stalls or something. I don't think it will, but I'm here as a safety net to make sure um, Carter is all good and he makes it home safely. Here is the code. I almost crashed into Carter's car right I now. I need to know everything. Who in the what and the where I need everything. Ooh, Trust me, I hear what you're saying, but I like it's good nice. what you're telling me. I'm curious, George, I happen to Porsche, five and a horse, Got the Lambo back. I'm excited to have it back at home. It needs to stay at home. It can't be, you know, at some random spot. Woo, guys, this thing was not easy to get started after sitting in storage for a few months. Guys, this Lamborghini Countach is one of the rarest Lamborghinis that you guys will see on the road today. And we're going to be using it for the gold digger test on my new girlfriend, Maggie. And let me explain to you how this setup is going to work. It's pretty interesting. So Maggie right now is waiting to be picked up for our next date. I'm going to pull up in this red Lamborghini, but because it was in storage, she has no idea that I actually have one of these Lamborghinis. So I'm gonna pull up and pretend that it's my car and she's gonna see it and be impressed. And then I'm gonna explain to her that this actually isn't my car, it's actually my friend's car and I'm just dropping it off right here. In which case I'm going to switch cars to a smart car and say, this is my real car. Hop on in, let's go on our date. And let's see if she's going to go on a date with me after realizing I'm not maybe as rich and famous as she thought and I daily drive a smart car. That's the game plan. Let's go test it out and uh, she's waiting. So let's, uh, sorry, let's go do it. Are you it. ready? Yeah, let's go. So Maggie is standing here patiently and this is test number one. I'm having my friend pull up in Stove's new car. She's never seen Stove's car so she's gonna think this is a random dude pulling up and stopping and trying to flirt with her. Let's see how she reacts. Okay, I'm on the hidden camera. I gotta move, get in position right now. See you in a bit. Hey, excuse me. 
Hey, yeah, you. Um, are you, do you know where Tatsu is? It, it's like right around here. Are you from around here? No, I'm actually not from around here. I'm just visiting. You're not? Would you be willing to help me find it? I have like no service around here. Um, it's supposed to be this ramen place that's really good. Yeah, I can I'm look supposed it up to meet my, people there. Yeah, I could look it up on my maps for you if you don't have service. Okay. Um, you said Tatsu ramen? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I think I'm kind of lost. Yeah, if you go like right here, if you want to look at that. Okay. You can take a peek at it for a sec. Okay. I love your car. Thank you so I much. Love the colors. It's like the blue and pink. Favorite yeah. colors? Yeah. Your eyes are blue. Like yeah, it matches your eyes and your leggings. Aww. It would look good on you. If you want it, you can. Do you want to come with and get ramen? Uh, that's a very tempting offer, but I'm actually waiting for my boyfriend right now. You're waiting for your boyfriend? Yeah. Are you sure? Yeah. How long are you in LA for? Um, like another week or so. Okay. I'm just out here visiting okay. him. Okay. So. Well, since I have your phone, I'm gonna put my number in your phone. Uh. <laughs> I mean, I guess. <laughs> and then. But like I said. When, when your boyfriend decides to show up, hit me up, and right. we can get food. I mean, he's not a boyfriend, a boyfriend, but... A real boyfriend? Yeah, a real All right. boyfriend. I believe you. Okay, yeah. think bye. about it. You got my number. Yeah, bye. Stove just called me and said test one is complete and that she did not go in the car and she did not go on a date with him and she is still waiting there for me to pick her up. So she passed the first test, which means it's time to move on to test number two. So let's get this Lambo started and let's go pick her up and see if she will pass the second test. Let's go. Alright guys, here we go. Let's see what she does when she sees the Lambo. Hey, what's up? Maggie, how's it going? Hi, how are you? Is Good. Yeah. Good to see you. How are you? I hope you weren't Good. waiting too long. No, I wasn't waiting long at all. This is crazy. I yeah. Love Lamborghinis. Yeah. This is so nice. Actually, a lot of people think these are Ferraris, so <laughs> you must know your cars. Right. Yeah. Yeah, because it's red, and most Lamborghinis are like not red. Ferraris are usually red. Yeah. So you like it? You think it's yeah. cool? Yeah. I can't believe that like this is what we're going to go on a date in. Yeah. In LA, like this is crazy. Yeah, I know. It must be like such a crazy LA yeah. like experience and stuff. No, this is like the coolest thing. Yeah, it's a crazy. You're driving this on the road, you won't believe how many like heads it'll turn and it's such a crazy driving experience and stuff. Yeah. Would you mind <laughs> taking a picture of me for Instagram for it? Oh, with the Lambo? Yeah. Oh, uh, sure. Yeah, no, of course. You do uh, Instagram a lot? Um, sometimes, but I just feel like this is the kind of thing that you can't pass up on. Yeah, awesome, here you go, how's that look? Oh, that looks good. Yeah, you look good in that. Thank you. Yeah, so, um, I actually had to tell you something. Ooh, okay. So, um, this actually isn't my car. Really? Yeah, it's actually my friend's car, and I was just like holding on to it for the day, you okay. know, and just like watching it, so I'm actually dropping it off at his place later. All right. Yeah. If you're dropping this off for your friend, how are we getting to our date? Oh, uh, well, I have a, another car, actually. Okay. So this isn't mine. This is my friend's. Got it. So I'm actually just leaving it here for him to pick it up. All right. And um, um, I have the the keys to my car. Okay. Where is your car? It's actually just, um, oh, there it is. It's right here. Okay. Yeah, this is, uh, this is my Lamborghini. <laughs> you know, this, this is, is so cute. Oh, yeah. I, I mean, love this. I think it's manly and cool. You know, I think yeah. it can compete with the the Lambo. Yeah, I mean, maybe it doesn't compete with the Lambo. Yeah, okay, I that's true. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it's not a Lambo, but it's, you know, it's my, it's my daily whip, you know? Yeah. yeah. I feel like, who cares, like, what kind of car you drive? Or, yeah. Like, whatever, where you live, where you're from. I feel yeah, like it's yeah. all just about who you're with and what you're doing and if you're having a good time, so. Yeah, it's true. I mean, I'm sorry I can't give you, like, the full L.A. Lamborghini no. experience, but if you still want to go on a date, we can take the little smart car out and, uh, you know, have a good time. I still want to go on a date. Yeah? I want to spend time with you. Yeah. Okay. All right. Well, here, let me unlock it, and uh, let's go. Okay. Let's do it. I'm excited. Ah, me too. It's going to be a fun date. You know, this isn't a Lamborghini, but it is a, actually a really fun car to drive. I'm excited. I've always actually kind of wanted to drive it up. Yeah, it's like the world's so smallest cute. car. Yeah, it's awesome. Got to buckle up. Car is too big for me. Yeah, you know, and the Lamborghini is kind of like very attention getting yeah. and stuff, so it's kind of nice to be low key. Oh, and I like that. 
All right, guys, we are now back at my place. Maggie and I just finished our date. It was a wonderful date, but I think it's time to let her in on the secret that we did the gold digger test on her. And I'll be curious to know how she's gonna react when we let her know. I wonder if she's gonna be upset or if she had any clue that we were kind of doing anything suspicious, but let's go talk to her and see if she uh, gets upset with me. Hey, Maggie, come outside for a second. So I got something to tell you. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so while you're waiting for the day, you know how it's kind of, you're waiting for like a few minutes for yeah. me to come. So Stove and Ryan and I set up a gold digger test on you. Really? <laughs> yeah. And so if you don't know what that means, we were trying to test you to see if you were into me because of the fame and the money or if you're into me for actually me. And so that was a test that we did. That's why we had someone pull up in a nice car and try to get your number. That's why I came up with my friend's Lambo. Really? And I told you it wasn't mine. We took the smart car. I wanted to see how you're going to react to see if you really liked me for me or if you're in it for like the whole LA vibe and stuff. And you know, amazingly, you passed both the tests <laughs> and you didn't care about the Lambo and all that no, stuff. And you know, the date that we had was so wonderful. I so, know, it was so great. I hope you're not upset with me for no. putting you to the test. You know, I just no, you can't no, be no. too sure. There's a lot of people out here in LA that are all about the clout and the money and stuff like that. And you know, you're definitely not one of those. You're very sweet, and you know, I'm super thankful that I found someone like you. Aww, so, thank you. You're yeah, not mad about time. the gold digger test? No. Okay, no. thank you. All right, perfect. That's All right. <laughs> Guys, it's a success. She is not a gold digger. She is amazing. And uh, she's not even mad at me for putting her to the test, which is awesome. See you guys on the next vlog. Bye. Bye. Boom. That's for you, Matt. And Jep, if you're watching. Boom, boom, boom. Oh, that's harder. I'm feeling good. I'm feeling good about this one.